challenges along the way? <laughs> no, no. Uh, fortunately, the... Okay, so... Um... I need to open text messages... Words, blah blah blah. Um, B, good to hear you. Finally, been a long time since we talk. Since when Jackie passed away. How you doing? How you think? My son is dead. But I am hanging in there. Call in to offer my condolences. Mm. Offer your condolences. Ay, so Christophe, you lived under our roof. Have the decency not to treat me like some stranger you just met. I was going to call you. I prepared an ofrenda for Jaquito. We can't let him go without a proper goodbye. The ceremony will be at the Coyote Cojo. Many of his friends will be there. Hi, Buckhead. How you doing tonight? Say no more, Mama Wells. I'll be there. I did not doubt it for a second. Ahí te veo, B. All right, um, heroes. No. Fuck. Okay. Here. Nah, I don't think so. All right. What um, I'm also having to remember how to play the game. Very sleepy. Well, go to bed. <clears throat> did I already get that? Yeah, I did. Tee hee, almost let a car hit me. Tee hee. Starfield is only downloading a 50 megasecond for me. That's weird. My uh, preload's already done. It only took uh, half an hour.
3.5 hours remaining. That's odd. It's actually very strange because mine went very quickly. I don't know if I can actually see uh, what my download was. Um, mine peaked at 40 meg a second. Oops, um, this, this, there we Yeah, that probably that's probably Ah, that's why. Okay. I didn't understand what you had said at first. I get it now. Your download is about eight times faster. Yeah. Well, and it's, uh, what is it, um, 300 down, but only like 11 up. It's either three or 400, I can't remember. I think it's 400. <laughs> you will. Name's Dino. Deal with downtown, city center. Dean. Yeah, I know. Heard about you. Odd stuff. Need anything, you call me. Remember, yep. Dino knows everybody. Dino knows everybody. I'm aware this is unorthodox, but <laughs> hi, Cable Spark. How you doing tonight? You're late, not by much. You run a pizza joint. <laughs> glad you're doing all right yeah I uh, missed stream last night I intentionally took a nap so that I'd be able to stream last night and then I ended up sleeping 15 hours and slept through the night oops <laughs>
level 30 gear. <laughs> oh shit. Hey, this here, Dino, you gonna buy a pizza or what? <laughs> Hey, yo, this here's Dino's. Bibbity bobbity boop, you gonna buy a fucking pizza? Sounds restful? It was okay. I just surprised the hell out of myself by sleeping that much. to be just running 2,000 kilometers. Well, a thousand of that was... Um, swim, uh, sw swimming, there we go. Mistro, hi! <laughs> How are you doing tonight? Already? Sure got that ear to the ground. Siempre. Anyway, you need something. You know where to find me. Oh, it's 4 a.m. and I can't sleep, so yeah, hey. <laughs> Aww. Well, I hope um, when you do try to sleep next, they do hope you get some... Let me try that again. I do hope you can get some sleep when you do try to sleep next. There we go. Oh, my lord. Sorry, but the hell? your no. car. No Sorry, I I can't. I, I I no. I want pizza now. Pizza does sound good. Fuck, I haven't had pizza since Jack since uh, Jack forked money to have uh, uh for me to have pizza. Because they don't reply to do to anything, they do pass out. So you know why? At least that's fair. Steal the police car. You know you want to. Not wrong, but I'm in an area where I'm way under leveled for the enemies here. You're under level and need a police escort. <laughs> oh, if only that's how that shit worked. Yeah, they are. Yeah. The Valentinos are definitely too high level for me. got to get rid of it. Really? It's pretty massive. V. Nice to see you. Oye, sit. Sit. You want a beer? Wouldn't mind one. A lot of time has passed. How you been? Hanging in there somehow? 
Somehow. You could have come over for dinner. Nuestra casa es tu casa. Hmm. But okay. We put it behind us. Hmm? I am in the middle of preparing an ofrenda. There is still so much to take care of. Not ofrenda? What's that exactly? Friends and family. We gather to celebrate the departed. Our memories of them. And we bring things they loved in life and might need in the after. Sure some beard be at the top of Jackie's list. <laughs> And there will be beer. Could help you with that? Gracias, mi cielo. But I will manage. It's enough you come to say goodbye. Want to take part in the ceremony, but... I want to do it the right way. In line with tradition. Mm-hmm. But... Something I'd, I'd lay by his casket that would do justice to his memory, I... I don't got anything. But your heart... He's in the right place, mi niña. Don't worry. He's symbolic. Look for something in his garage. His past is all there. Jackie had a garage? He used it for his motorcycle, mostly. But not so long ago he moved in. You'll find something there, I'm sure. Won't mind me digging through his stuff? No, mija. He is gone, and funerals are for the living, not the dead. Toma, take the key. Ah, not wrong. Thanks, Mama Wells. Ah, don't mention it, V. You have respect. I admire that. The garage is on Republic. Ahí te veo. Ivy. You here alone? This is not exactly the safest neighborhood in town, Misty. I used to sit on the stairs when I was 10. 26 now. If anything was gonna happen, it wouldn't have taken this long. What are you doing here? Sitting and waiting. And yeah, waiting for him. Though I know he's never coming back. Lately, I've just been coming here to sit. An hour. Sometimes two. I know it's gonk, it's just... I miss him. A lot. Wanna sit? Catch up? Hardly gonk at all. Just... Well, human. I guess. You know each other long? Half our lives. Grew up in the same streets. Saw each other a lot, but... Just never got together. Till you're back. Yeah. Best darn year of my life. Jack talked about you. A lot. Always saying how much you meant to him. Did he really say that? I bet he used different words. <laughs> Maybe, but... That's what he meant. I really believe that. You actually got to know him. The real Jackie. Everybody else thought he was a goofball with a rough-hewn face and an edge. But they're wrong. What did you see in him? Let me tell you what he told me once. Told me he'd take a bullet for me. In an instant. Even if it'd kill him. Spoken like a true Haywood boy. A man. With dreams. Ambitions. Only thing they cost him was his life. There's a huge chunk of his past in there. How come you're outside? I don't have the key. Jackie never gave you a set? You two didn't get that far. He offered, but I wanted him to have his own space. Just his own. Mama Wells is having a send-off for Jackie. I need to find something he really cared about. Mind giving me a hand? I'm not sure I should go in there, V. 
Still too soon. No, it's not that. Mama Wells and I aren't exactly on the best terms. She wouldn't want me touching any of his things, disturbing the memory. That I know. Jackie'd want you here. That's more important. Come on. Yeah, I miss him too. Fine piece of metal and mechanics. <laughs> he was so psyched. <laughs> Jackie loved to pump iron, didn't he? He called it his form of meditation. He used to say, barbells are the best listeners. They understand all your problems and never give you gonk advice. Yeah, I don't think it should be. <laughs> You're not wrong. <laughs> Gotta be hanging here since 2020. You just have that effect. <laughs> Still full. His favorite. Strategic reserve. No touching. How come? ¿Por qué no puedes tocar una reserva estratégica, va? <laughs> Oh, Jackie. That a... a mandala? Mm hmm. Oof. It's a long story. Hey, you all right? I'm so much better than all right. I once told Jackie he should sweep all the dark energy out of this place. A sand mandala would do the trick, for example. He told me that out of sand he'd build a castle. A home, the Wells family hideout, stronghold, something. I guess you made a bigger impression than you thought. I guess I did. It's beautiful. It's hideous. But it's also the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Jackie's favorite tequila. Still sealed. It's his lucky charm. One of the first bottles ever made by Jesus de Abajo. The founder of Sensan Tequila. Only a hundred of them left in the world. All owned by the one percent. How did Jackie get this one? Some shriveled abuela in Mexico sold it to him. Told him de Abajo had stolen her recipe. <laughs> leather belt sort of a memento his dad's he used to beat both Jackie and his mom with it until one day Jackie fought back kicked his butt told him he'd kill him next time old man was hospitalized and then he left why did he hold on to it in case his dad ever comes back <sighs> yeah an aquarium? It used to be tacos. And taco was? Miss Fish. A dwarf shark. Like, Minnie. Sounds like a mighty expensive fish. <laughs> oh, I don't think he bought it. Love to poke around engines. He was 15 when he first got on a bike. Knowing him, it is a miracle he never wiped out. Guess no man cave's complete without some of those, huh? He said they're collectibles, 
They don't print them anymore. It's definitely why they're up there, yeah. <coughs> For whom the bell tolls, Ernest Hemingway. Jack read it a dozen times, always right before a big job. He said the guy who wrote it was tougher than Morgan Blackhand. You read it? Is it any good? I... <laughs> I never got the chance. It'd be a good tribute for the Ofrenda, though. Jack, pure and simple. Well, you got something for your Ofrenda. But we could look around a little more. I mean, there's nothing else to look at. Oh, wait. Nice still. Huh. Gotta be Jackie's dad. Old school ganger. Valentino's, of course. Did you meet him? No, I only ever heard about him. But he didn't exactly inspire many fond memories. Young Jackie. Hmm. Where are you going? Actually, V, I think I'll stay a while. Say bye to him here. Mama Wells wouldn't want me there anyway. What happened between you two? What's the beef? Let's just say she didn't see me as daughter-in-law material. What did she have against you? That my name wasn't Camila and I wasn't Jackie's ex-output. Camila was Mama Wells' favorite. Right. You gotta come, Misty. Got a right to be there. I'd rather not get in Mama Wells' way. It's for family. You were family to him. I guess you're right. Thanks, V. So? Shall we go? You ever thought you might leave Night City? Sure. Once upon a time, I even tried. Seriously? Meaning... Packed my bags and hopped on a plane? To Nepal. Thought I'd stay there. After a week, I realized I couldn't live without the traffic outside my window and my neighbors hollering. a glass to him, Padre. A few glasses. De acuerdo. P. It's good you're here. We're about to start. Sit down, please. Maybe. I thank you all for coming today. I'm not going to tell you what kind of man my son was, or lament about how much I miss him. Instead, I'll tell you a story. When he was about 19 years old, Jackie was in the Valentinos. They were at war with Maelstrom back then. I get a call from the hospital. They tell me he got shot. Three times, just by the heart. He was conscious when I get there. So many tubes coming out of him. He looked like a, like a pulpo, like an octopus or something. He tell me, he said, No te preocupes, mama. Look, I'm bulletproof. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. And when I go, he take off his Valentino's ring. He swear he won't need it anymore. 
But he was not scared. He just didn't want me to worry. <laughs> Descansa en paz, mi hijo. Among the membership of the Night City Devils Boxing Club, we had this saying. Make your best friends among the fighters who knock you out cold. And it's true. Jackie's arm was a cannon. No one's ever hit me as hard. <laughs> I can still almost feel it. Twelve rounds, buddy. Me mandó Camporta. Lamenta no estar aquí. Todavía le quedan cuatro años que cumplir. Me pidió que leyera esto. Recuerdo cuando Jackie se nos unió. Era un niño fuerte. Cuando decía que iba a hacer algo, cumplía. Tenía olor, ol, 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 honor. Podría haber llegado lejos. Mis condolencias a la familia. Que descanse en paz. Anyone else? I, uh... I often think back to the first time me and Jack met. It feels like it happened a century ago. At another time, in another place. Jackie saved my life. And then, years later in Night City, he saved it again. At a time when I thought I'd lost absolutely everything. I found my own freedom then. But it would not have happened without him. Jackie Wells. Always hungry for more and never gave up. Not once. Once he set his mind on something. He was ready to die to achieve it. He... He once told me, Chica, the one thing we can't do is be afraid of others. He kept Haywood in his heart, always. It made him who he was, but most importantly, everyone saw Jackie as a grinning charmer who saw the good in everyone, everything. They were wrong. Jackie Wells was a hell of an ambitious chum who never gave up and whose drive cost him his life. But he did in life what he said he'd do. Reached for fortune and fame. No fear in his eyes or heart. When you go to war as a boy, you have a great illusion of immortality. Other people get killed, not you. Then, when you are badly wounded the first time, you lose that illusion. Rest easy, Chum. I would like to say a toast. Or me. I forgot to go to his funeral. Thank you for your kind words, V. I'm glad you're here. It was a beautiful offering that we gave him. A lot of people come today. Even that putica Jackie was messing around with. Her name is Misty. What? Misty. She was very important to him. Do you understand? Go. Invite her along for dinner. It's the least she deserves. Do you know what? You're a good woman. Jackie would want you to have these. <laughs> Are you sure? Jackie, kill me. 
if I got so much as a scratch on it. So don't get any scratches on it. Thank you. I'll take such good care of it. Cuídate, be. I'm just still in that garage, mentally. I just need a sec. No scratches on it, right? Uh, Gonna miss him. Torn up. Says he feels like he lost one of his own. I wonder if he'll be as torn up after you <laughs> Me too, Chica. Chica. Uh, uh, me too. Not today. Here's to Jackie. Got off to greener pastures. Jackie Wells. Proud son of Haywood. I should mingle, Vic. Sure. See you later, V. Pour you another for Jaquito. Weird being here without Jackie. Can't shake the feeling I'm gonna turn around and see him sitting at the bar in his favorite spot. Where he always used to sit. Poor. For Jackie. Amen, sister. I'll have another. Have as many as you want. <laughs> you tell me that, I'll get fucking pissed. <laughs> I'll have another. Have as many as you want. Yeah, we'll leave it up there. Hey, you! Have a drink with us, hmm? To Wells? Think we might know each other. Gustavo Horta. V. Yeah, I've heard about you. Well, heartfelt condolences, friend. From me, Campo, and all the Valentinos. Thank you. How'd you meet Jackie? We started out together. In the Valentinos? No, in the fucking Bible book club. <clears throat> yeah, I got only good memories of him. Rest easy up there, brother. All right, why not? To Wells. May he rest in peace. Good for now. Thanks. See? You gotta know when to stop. All right, give me a break. All right, let's go. See? Gotta Nobody's know when to stop. They lost pretty good. She's a strong woman. Can we sit back down? Nope. <clears throat> Once you're done, you're done. Jackie chose his friends well. Ah, oh, fuck. Here to say goodbye to one of your own, Padre? I'm here to say goodbye to a good man. So, Padre, y you think Jackie's looking down upon us from up there? I believe he has met God, stood before him. That's it? I don't know if God left the meeting happy, but I'm pretty certain Jackie did. <laughs> Jackie, did you know him well? I remember the day his mother brought him into this world. The day his father left. The day he took you into his home. Yes, V. I knew him quite well. How are things in the streets? 
This is not the place to conduct business. Have some respect. I'm gonna move on. Go with God. I believe that's Vaya con Dios in um, Spanish. that oh, so good well I got Jackie's bike now so I have at least some form of transportation aside from fast travels um I need to get myself back into Let's go to this side job. Fuck it. Remember, no scratches. How you doing? How is your PC not dying from the GPU stress that is? <laughs> the wrong way. to a ripper man I yeah! I'll pay you Oops
Mm, depends. What's wrong with you? You serious? You want my patient history, too? Just want to be sure it's no cyber psychosis or anything. No, it's a... <laughs> Normal implant malfunction. Happy? You helping me or what? All right. Great. Why are we standing here? <laughs> to the car. Now. Satisfaction guaranteed, they said. Listen, if your input ever thinks about getting a Mr. Stud, you knock that gonk idea right out of his head. Thanks. Yeah, begin with this mechanical dick. Need it. <laughs> hey, <laughs> listen, thanks for not laughing at me. Appreciate it. It ain't easy, I'll tell you that. Fuck you. <laughs> Just our luck. Ah, go, just go, mow him down! Chill, chill. Be on in a sec. Chill? You tell me to chill? It burns! Fuck, it burns! Chill. I'm doing what I can. What I said to my output, she didn't like that too much. Stand still. Mm. Better go around. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ! Fuck! You really gotta keep yelling like that? Fuck! You don't even know how much it hurts? Like I'm screwing a goddamn pencil sharpener! <laughs> well, suffer in silence, Jim. Heard what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Real fucking funny. <laughs> I can't. Oh, I can't. Yeah, yeah, I'm getting there. I'm getting him there on time. Master. Okay, we're... Hey, you after! I'll call you! But... <sighs> All NCPD subcons. APB out for suspect accused of organized crime activity near Ross Street and Shipyard Way. Scavengers led by Yelena Sidorova, presumed Burns. armed and dangerous, like have assaulted mother. multiple homeless persons. Night City officials are offering a reward for neutralizing the threat. I can't! Oh, I can't! His little waddle. <laughs> yeah. Um, that reminds me. Crafting. Upgrades. Can I upgrade it yet? No, I am missing two more rare components. Oh, it hurts! It hurts like a motherfucker! It hurts, it hurts like a motherfucker. Couple packs of cigarettes. You can still hear him. <laughs> Didn't actually mean to short circuit him, I meant to ping.
There we go. до дровишки. Если хороший товар, я еще закажу. Но, пиздец какой. Да, беру, беру. Oh, that's right. Forget about these things. I take you to dumpster. How? Excuse you? That makes no sense. shoot their walls yeah I noticed short circuit this bitch come on shit smear come on shit smear <laughs> uh, well you can't get to me now can you Is it you? Is it you? <laughs> Who is a shrieking violin? Is it you? All right, who else? Gotta be at least one more in here. Ugh, I need to. Excuse me, Jesus. Need the perk that regenerates ram in combat. Yeah. Uh, ping. Can't.
think she's the last we'll one. You. Oh no, I'll she's not. You. Just two more. Shit. It's not what I wanted to do. Take your eyes. You hear? Shit, that's not what I wanted to do. Where are you, Sluka? Who is a shrieking violet? Is it you? Nice. Rare components. Very nice. Oh, that's right. I got a, um, character shards. Something I'm guessing up here. Oh no. <coughs> Got it. Okay. Um Crafting, upgrades, katana. There we go. Crafting level three, max stock. Right, that dude's body was there, but now it's not. saw a thing. They're dead. Calm down. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> oh, that got me. Oh my. Calling all NCPD subcons. Suspected organized crime activity reported over on Richmond Street. Intel indicates Maelstrom gang members dealing in illegal stimulants in the area. They're led by Tom Ayer, a.k.a. Emir. Um... Blades. Excuse me. A known serial killer. Night City authorities have offered a reward for neutralizing the group. Always got to check out our new gear. There we go. of analysis dead zed oh so this is a good time for you then hola been thinking about a new jacket what do you recommend what's it matter just pick something <laughs> god <laughs>
The joys of re retail work. What's it matter? Just pick something. Okay. Okay, yeah, that's totally fine. Sorry, honey, I just went to sell. That was all. For a katana build you're using an awful lot of quick hacks. Yeah, uh, <clears throat> yeah, well, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do early game to get things done. So if that means using a quick hack or two, so be it. <clears throat> Random hypodermic scattered around the trash. Yoink! Oh, <sighs> 
hate all the fucking fire. Great if I didn't have it. Yeah, I'm using the, I think I'm using the standard, uh, uh, no, uh, inventory. Yeah, I'm using the standard bounce backs. I need to be using these. That's why. It's been a while since I played the game, so I wasn't paying attention to the fact that I wasn't using the correct uh, thing. Booty cheeks. Hey, it's, it's me, the guy who, you know, guy with the smoking crotch. That's one way to put it. Anyway, just calling to say I transferred the funds. Uh, well, they managed to save your... Y you know. Yeah, as much as they could. At least the pain is gone. Anyway, once it heals, I'll get a better model. <coughs> Something top shelf. Mm-hmm. Just... Check the warranty next time. <laughs> Will do. Take care, man. <laughs> And that doesn't feel, feel satisfying. They just get hit for taking away. There's no visual gory effects. Some blood. Oh, and I guess I'm beheading them. <laughs> Smacked his ass so hard his head popped off. <laughs> Okay. 
game's got a lot of good moments, though, despite the minor downsides. Um... Oh, what is, um, as spoiled as to how does gore with melee and everything on the infected? Well, Left 4 Dead 2, they kind of had, it, it was a very ambitious thing, to be honest, but it was good for its time. Um... Is, was, whatever. <laughs> So I need to put the next couple of points into crafting. Let's see what else is there. Talk to the cops, pay off your debt. There is a cyber cycle nearby. Oh, it's this one. I didn't want to kill him. God damn it. I didn't want to kill him. You're supposed to pacify them, not kill them. Glad they're doing their absolute best to make the game as amazing as possible. With the, uh, the new DLC coming out, they've, um, they're reworking a fuck ton but I will only be playing this for probably another couple days and then it's to uh, Starfield till I get bored with that. They're pacified forever. There we go. Pacified. Okay, read the conversation, shards, <coughs> Brick and Alias, what the fuck are we gonna do, Brick? 
got a bad feeling Royce wants to fuck you in the ass and he got he's got the people to back him. We got to do something. Where the fuck have you been? I'm 100% or I'm 100 fucking percent sure he's going to he's gunning for my reins. I've been a walking corpse since yesterday and my advice is to get the fuck out while you can. You're rolling over. We have people too. Jesus, prick, I'm not gonna work for that rusty cum stain and that fucking psycho douche uh, smirk of his. Don't write that kind of shit, Al. You believe in me so much. Believe in me. Believe me when I say you gotta get the fuck out. Oh, fuck you. Uh, shit your shorts. Uh, shit your shorts all you want, but I won't let Royce get away with this. Poor Alice went cyber. Uh, went cyber psycho. Uh, open messages. Dino. Padre. Uh, Regina, here we go. V, you know some, uh, you know wild screaming at Totentons is in headline news. Uh, could just be Screamo Band's set rehearsal, that or something a shade more sinister. I don't need to remind you that this is a Maelstrom hotspot. If you confirm a cyber cycle behind this, please do your best to, please tr do try to keep them alive. Thanks. It was a gang dispute. The guy was one of Brick's people. Tried to take revenge on Royce. You can guess how his solo attempt at a vendetta panned out. Got pumped full of drugs, tortured and made into his wild attack dog of a bouncer. Uh, made this or made into this wild attack dog of a bouncer. As requested, I didn't flatline him, but honestly, I doubt there's much left to collect in the mental sense. So I scrounged up some more info. It looks like the guy was Brick's only devotee left. All of his other followers turned coat in a half a millisec. Uh, I'm not sure he can be saved, but maybe we'll at least learn something new about the onset of cyberpsychosis. Nice work. And I've got a perk point, so I'm going to put it into... Uh, we need Grease Monkey, don't we? So we need at least 12 in tech. Right? Yeah, 12 in tech. Okay. Um. Uh, what do we need? Blades. Um. Roaring waters, sting like a bee. Judge and Jury. Do we have that one unlocked yet? No, we don't. That's over here somewhere, I think. Oh, that's right. They took it out. I forgot about that. Here it is. Judge, uh, Jury and Executioner. Fiery Blast, Blessed Blade. Yeah, okay. So then, what about body? Um, Pack Mule, Regeneration, Steel and Chrome. Generation, Steel and Chrome. Uh, Invincible. is there. Tenacious V and Steel Shell. 
Alright, so none that I can get right now. What about... Uh, ninjutsu. Cool, ninjutsu is assassin. Silent and deadly. Um, then it's... Strike from the shadows. This one. Increase your crit chance while sneaking. Okay. I'm gonna do another Cyber Psycho if it's nearby. It's that one, there is one over here. I think we'll go do this one. The Cyber Psycho ones are fairly, for the most part, fairly easy to actually do. It's just a matter of physically doing them. Um, wrong button. I want this. That's weird. We heard north side seeing some action. Got mail strummers hauling ass out of there. Uh, go see what's going on exactly. Who would have thought? me. Bless your adorable sneeze. <laughs> Thank you. Alright.
<laughs> All right, um, shards. Tamara, I have been trying to reach you ever since they took me. I know you're looking and I know you'll find me eventually, but I don't know how to make it any easier. I don't think you can, I don't think I can get on the net, uh, or don't think I, don't think I can get on the net. I should have listened to you. Um, I should have listened to you when, or I should have listened when you taught me how uh, but now I fucked myself. Honestly, I don't even think you'll recognize me if you saw me. I know I don't. Uh, should just stick a barrel down my throat and be done with it. I'm such a fucking monster. Fuck me. Gang ain't taking me back, not with a, without a bag over my head. I got these, like, tractor hands and ugly ass sin red eyes. All I can think of now is your chooms who poisoned, uh, poisoned you to me. Um, telling you not to get with a Valentino, that he'll leave you for someone else, vanish without a word. I'm gone and they'll beat their chests all justified and tell you told you so, but couldn't be more wrong. It's driving me loco. I feel like my head's gonna explode into a million pieces. Uh, I can feel the pressure building and building and building, and I don't know when it's gonna pop. Our kid was a Valentino, not a Maelstromer. Uh, Borg fiends must have had an axe to grind with them, uh, cause they stuffed him with implants like a fucking Christmas turkey and just watched and waited for him to blow. Same would happen to anyone chipped that fast. Body didn't have time to adjust to the wear and turned him psycho. Good thing he still had a little self-control uh, self left. Man, I could take him down quietly. Pawn, thank you for the raid. I appreciate you. Uh, looks like our guy didn't even have, uh, didn't even have to piss, uh, piss them off. A while ago, Maelstrom put out the word it was looking for uh, for volunteers to assess some of our new wear. Ooh, you were playing Pokemon Platinum version. Nice! How was that? Were you, um, just starting out again, or were you loading up a new, or a, an old save? Um... Maelstrom put out a word. It was looking for volunteers uh, to test some new wear. Obviously, nobody stepped up, so this Borg fucks just started scooping peeps up off the streets. Uh, Valentino's been looking for this kid for a while, not to mention the runner who swarmed the net with data feelers trying to track him down. Eventually, must have broke free and fought for his life, made the Maelstrom's reap... Uh, made the maelstromers reaped what they sowed. The whole thing backfired on them spectacularly. Good thing you managed to get him down, or to get him to go down softly. Kid's still young. Maybe the right kind of help can look... Maybe with the right kind of help, he can learn to adapt to his new condition. Last time I did a save was back in August 17th, 2022. Loading up an old save and wondering what the fuck was I doing? I know how that feels. Which is usually why I end up um, restarting a save of Skyrim or Cyberpunk even anytime I play them again. Um... 
character tech Hi DF, how you doing? All right, so I need that, so I might as well go for Strike from the Shadows. I'm all right, slightly tired. Yeah, I'm doing okay. Um, just plugging along with this. I started a new, um, oh geez. Um, I started a new uh, Stardew, uh, Stardew Valley file again. I started a new one like, I don't know, maybe a week ago. And I started a new one again tonight because, well, obviously off stream, but I started a new one again tonight because I, um, I wanted to, um, I knew what I was doing, so in the old file I didn't really know what I was doing, and now that I do, I was like, alright, well, I can take what I've learned and do it ten times faster to get basically to where I was in half the time. So, I'm enjoying that again. start to but haven't played it in a bit I go back to it every so often but I don't play um, I don't play Stardew um, uh, unmodded anymore I always play it modded I can't handle it unmodded anymore hey V could you investigate something for me caught wind of a scuffle at the docks could be junkies, but this thing smells like a cyber psycho flare-up to me. And I want to know if drugs played any part. A cold body's no good to check, so keep him alive. Uh, yes and no. Um, I do have some cheat mods, but they're more for, like, um... They're more for, like... Oh, uh, what's the word? Um inconvenience things rather than anything else um but otherwise uh what i'm doing with it basically is i've got uh ugh, excuse me i've got a large mod pack um with it so I'm using that large mod pack, uh, which is Stardew Valley very expanded, basically. Tedious tasks go to go through. Yeah, you're not wrong. Lovely neighbor. Huh. Hey, Frank. Hey, yeah. Can you take my shift tonight? You're yanking me right now. Been on my feed for 48 hours already. Jesus Christ. Listen, buddy, you know I wouldn't be asking if I didn't have a good reason. So what is it? I landed two ticks to a, uh, two ticks to a blackouts game tonight. You know my kid's crazy about him. This was the only game we could squeeze in real short notice. Please, Frank, I'll get you back. Three of your shifts for this one of mine. Hmm, fine. But throw in some stems so I don't keel over on duty. 
Frank, my man, anything, thanks, you're the best. Yeah, yeah, no problem. And don't forget to snap a still uh, of you and the kiddo, Mr. Dad of the Year. Poor guy. me this one's annoying well 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 <laughs> what the fuck is going on not like this <laughs> How the fuck? Oh, Alec, my dear Alec, I told you to stay away from glitter. That stuff is cooked and get cooked to get you hooked. Why it hurts so bad when you try to get off it, the pain's designed to resist any drugs or editors. Only thing that could help is, uh, para paramodical from body weight life preservation systems uh far as i can tell they've got someone in uh some in one of their warehouses in little china problem is paramodical costs an arm and a leg and you're gonna have to pop it like lulu beans for a while to keep the glitter jitters at bay Uh, message her about this message, Regina. One more thing, the security in these places is always beefed up, so chances are a guy is going to pack a heavy punch. Undercovered a small-time drug ring at a port with a buffet-style variety in what they're pushing. Folks buying it are mostly the local have-nots, um, and the rate of cyber psychotic breaks, cyber psychotic breaks, among them is on the rise. I think what we're seeing is a connection, a uh, connection driven by the new drug cocktail that's making waves. Uh, got the guys sleeping soundly over here. Won't be up anytime soon. Ready for pickup. Uh, guessing lab work should show you what kind of crap he's got swimming around in his bloodstream. Great. Appreciate the heads up. Corps don't like getting their hands dirty with people living on the on curb level. Uh, but when a dealer mixes glitter with coal dust or some other shit, they get eddy signs, eddy signs in their eyes. The money still lands in their pockets and another... A uh, bunch of the city's undesirables uh, fades from the streets forever. Win-win. Uh, is that a thing I can... whoops, uh, shards. Um, yeah. E9, BD, BD, BD 55. I drew up the accounts for this month, and it looks like we made a handsome profit off our original investment. I talked to Frankie, the guard, who claims the glitter cut with, uh, paracetamol. Yeah, it's paracetamol. Glitter cut with paracetamol is by far the most popular choice. Um... Jesus, my brain. Uh, he also pointed out that the attempted break-ins into the warehouse have increased seeing as um, have increased seeing as our highest 
or as our newest blend is highly addictive. Thus, he's demanding more guards and enhanced security measures. Needless to say, I nipped that idea in the bud immediately. I told him that we could always replace him with the Tang Tao robot, uh, Kang Tao robot if he can't adequately perform his duties, so I doubt we'll ever he or we'll hear any more complaints out of him. That being said, we should consider the long term. Maybe it's worth swapping him out for a robot. In any case, I'm expecting continued profits in the short term, though we still uh, lack reliable long term data as uh, as we shall Jesus Christ my brain it's really hard to read tonight uh, as we shall see how the product affects our customers lifespans reports of an increase in cyberpsychosis cases recently or directly correlates with our distribution network but of but of course we'll omit that from the report in a few months, we might be in a position to model some accurate simulations. Uh, to that end, I give or I gave Frank the task of gathering the necessary data with his or within his territory. God damn, that was hard to read. Reading is easier or harder depending on the day for me. Unfortunately. Oh, hello. There we go. All right, I think we're gonna head back to the apartment. But we're gonna run there rather than use the bike. Get more um, experience on the way. Jesus Christ, that scared me. <laughs> <laughs>
Okay. Um. What's going on? I live right upstairs. So keep on living and stop minding other people's biz. Mendez, hold on. It's his neighbor. Is there anything I can do? Maybe. You know Barry at all? More or less. Struck up a convo once or twice. He's a friend from the precinct. Left the force not long ago. He broke down after his best friend died. We're worried he'll do something stupid. Relax, Petrova. Barry's got nerves of steel. He's just a spiteful old bastard. Mendez! Could you check on him when he's chilled down? Sure, why not? Not like we're miles apart. Thanks. Just be patient. Cops falling on rough times can be touchy. Anyone falling on rough times can be touchy. The fuck? Hey, Barry? Everything all right in there? away okay all right let's see here Um, actually, that's a good point. Um, we have enough money. We might as well go and pay off, um, our debt. It's not exactly like we have the, uh, the body right. for it currently. Got it. Sure. I always wish that you could just go and explore those areas instead of just being forced to only go from that floor to the bottom. Besides, I would rather pay Victor off now, while I have the money, than to need the money and still have to pay him off. I finally scrounged up enough eddies to pay you back in full. Hold on to him, just in case. You need him more than me. Not taking him all the way to my grave, Vic. Here. And thanks again for doing so much work on me without ever seeing an any. That's what friends are for.
Got a few questions about Silverhand and this chip. I'm no expert, but fire away. See what I can do. How is it even possible seeing him? Well, that biochip is designed for users to communicate with constructs. It's just doing its job. So I got Arasaka to thank. You know, I wager you have the lowest net worth of any relic owner out there. <laughs> Tried to flatline me. Johnny did. What? What can I do to suppress him? You know, avoid my murder? Well, long as you don't give him control, can't do too much harm. Of course, that won't necessarily be possible after some time. And what then? What do you say we don't let things get that far? Find a way to get rid of Silverhand, and fast. Why am I reliving Johnny's memories? You two share a brain now. He has access to your senses, perceptions, even some memories. Likewise, you've got a glimpse into his. After a while, we won't even know whose is whose. How's Biz going? Uh, can't complain. Corporals learn to keep their distance, and Sokka's back hiring lone mercs. They all gotta have the newest, shiniest implants. I think you got Misty here to help. Handles your griping well. Yeah, renting out her shop's the best decision I ever made. Know what? Seems like you're the only person in Night City who's happy with his lot. You get to a certain age, you drop all your illusions. Life just gets easier from there. Yeah. Not wrong. Was thinking about swapping some crumb. Have a look. Um. Let's see. Thirty thousand. But I have enough body for it. Looks like. Yeah. I just need the money. Okay. Easy. I like how you can change your appearance there. <coughs> Excuse me. Um... I like doing the cyber psycho missions rather than the gigs. Um, that's a high danger. Okay, H. All right, yeah. Been avoiding doing the uh, story missions primarily due to the fact that the story missions get progressively harder very, very quickly. It's not very forgiving. So I like kind of doing some of the uh, side biz stuff to level myself up before going and doing that stuff. hungry. I mean, granted, I'm just about always hungry when I stream, but I'm trying to decide what I want to get out of the fridge. Just realized 
realize they, uh... Ironically, reseeding the, uh, the, um, CPU cooler has made it so that my computer is at a max of 71 Celsius and hasn't gone any higher. Which is very strange to me. What's the difference between a broken bone and a broken heart? System error. I repeat, system error. Ah, oh, damn it to hell. Okay, vendor. Body. Yeah, you're okay. Gonna find you. Okay, um... Could take a bite. <laughs> of what? <laughs> um... Cat food. Bite all. Fuck it. <clears throat> The way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. What have I missed this time? Enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Arisaka and the tiger claws are in bed together. Go figure. Every corp plays dirty. Except the streets are more than that. They're filth. So the corpse leave it to the gang. Suits collars and gets soiled. Surprised? No, I mean, if Evelyn wanted to disappear, especially from Arasaka, she could have done better. This whole situation's bent over. Cheeks spread wide. Someone's in a great mood. Not every day a half-brain dead chick drags me around a cat house on a wild horde chase. So having a grand old time. You think Judy's lying? Why? 
little something called intuition V. Ever heard of it? <laughs> oh, so what you meant to say was you're full of shit. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> Uh. Yo, hold on. You take a blow-up doll, remodel the hole, and, and that's cheap. That's infidelity. Uh, no. Well, how's that any different from some dollhouse ass? Cause the ass is meat, not latex. That's so hard to understand. Meat, right. No feeling going on, no thinking, no awareness. It's empty. Might as well be latex. Masturbation, sophisticated kind. That's all it is. Whoa. Uh, <laughs> makes perfect sense, that. <laughs> Whatever gets your rocks off, dude. That's right, we gotta wait. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? So how's this all work? An algorithm pilots the doll's motor functions. It takes your profile data and transforms into experiences in real time. Memory dampers on the doll's behavioral chip block any recall of the session. So there'll be no trace of the meeting. Well, I could say yes, but that would strip it of mystery and suspense, wouldn't it? Once you're in there, you set the stakes. You're saying it's not dangerous, but there's some risk involved. That is one way to put it. One thing is for sure. You never get what you expect. Consider my interest piqued. How could you possibly know what I'm looking for? Clouds always knows. Your deepest desire, we find it. You'll have your needs fulfilled. And maybe much more. Less is not a word we use around here. Looking for an Evelyn Parker. She work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Jack in, please. <laughs> Huh. I'm sorry. Did she finally say anything useful? <laughs> Fuck the menu. Let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their carts close, fine. We'll play our own game. Yeah. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Samurai. And saved. Now, bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Hmm. Two matches. Interesting. 
Is that normal, or...? Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with... unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be? Angel or Sky? It's funny. Angel is more... like... gay? I want to say. Thinking Angel looks good. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Angel awaits you in booth six. Disconnect, please. That it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Go eat a dick, Johnny. Don't worry, all your grown up. Thank you. We hope you enjoy your stay. I guess that makes you a real deviant. Would have had more choices if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. Alrighty. Just wanted to check them all I could. Where's that other camera? There it is. Ah, oh, fuck. I have to wait for that one. Curious if I can... <laughs> oh, 
that's what I need more tech ability. I know, I was just trying to see if I could do anything else. Not bad, but it would be much better, Rio. I would eat those thighs. What do you mean, real? She's all ones and zeros. Do you mean I can ask her to do anything? Literally anything? Ask? It's not about asking, man. You just gotta be programmed. As establishments fuck sideways go, this one takes the whole damn pie. Hear that? At least I would hear no laments about pain. It hurts. It hurts. It's a hologram. What's so hard to get? Let me have my fantasies. <laughs> Not like you know how to hack it, so why don't we just shut up and enjoy the show? <laughs> You can take it up with them. Manager. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you. Here, now. You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? This conk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. Oh, no shortage of wise asses. I'll see. In a minute. <laughs> you don't know I'm in here. Tee hee hee, bye. People I know real well get to use my real name. But we'll get to know each other well in no time, honey. Sure, why not? Do what you do best. I know that you're dying. <laughs> Safe word. <laughs> How do you know I'm dying? Deep inside, you fear this power before it so what if i do why do you care of all the voices in your head the loudest is that calling for help that's why you're here look around tell me what you see there's something in the mirrors way back it's a projection your inner landscape just what i needed therapy with a robo hooker I'm not going to analyze you. I won't play any tricks. My sole aim is to fulfill your greatest need. Listen, 
I'm looking for someone who worked here. Evelyn Parker. Know her? Know where she is? You must see the big picture. You focus too much on details, minor ones, like Evelyn. Please don't act like you know me. I just want some answers. But are you asking the right questions? How can you change what has already happened? Got only one right question now. The one I asked. Where's Evelyn Parker? Why'd the manager say she didn't work here anymore? When was she last here? You know anything? These are questions to which you'll find the answers on your own. I was told this place would fulfill my deepest desires. Not what I was expecting, this. When true desires go unfulfilled, they turn into needs. We are here to reach for them and beyond. So what's it I need so badly? To come to terms with the fact that you died once already. Only to face another kind of death. Coming to terms. Sure, let me just curl up on the floor and wait for... <laughs> Whatever. Give up. That's what you're saying. Actually, I'm saying the opposite. You wish to leave something behind. A piece of yourself. That's why this all began. You wish to be remembered. Wanted to reach the top. Be someone. Still do. But seems like that might not happen anymore. Still. If I gotta die, I wanna go down in history. Fuck it, even a footnote would do. And after that? Do you think death is a disappearing act followed by exactly nothing? People I've lost live on in my thoughts and that's what i'll be a memory or just some stranger's voice in my own body yapping away mm, no longer part of the world you will still have an impact there so you believe death is not the end after all reassuring i think i might just be afraid so I imagined these things to distract myself from the thought of the void. If what I saw before is any indication, I... You are sensitive. That does not make you weak. Try to suppress your emotions, and you'll drown. Sound advice to anyone. So, where do we go from here? This is the part where I tell you what you must do. Oh, okay. Be my guest. You've never backed down from anything, so don't stop now. Not one step backwards. In this city, people die on their way to the corner store for a scop pop. But that threat's never stopped you. You dive into the middle of it all. Always have. Things are moving way too fast. Around me. Without me, I... I can't keep up. A minor delusion. The truth is, we and our paths are braided. Never-ending. Ever-transforming. Not being, but becoming. And what's happening inside you, it could change the world. Listen, V. Never look back. If you must kill, kill. If you must burn all the world to the ground, then let it burn. Okay? Thanks... for this. I... I don't want to go out there. No one ever does. But eventually, we all must. Thanks... for this. I... No. Ah, fine. Samurai. 
What? What happened? You interrupted the session? Did I do something wrong? W were you not satisfied? Had all kinds of things going on in my head lately. This was different, refreshing. Yes, that is what we do at Clouds. Think I get why people come here, come back. But I came for something else. Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Wait just a sec. That's not how this works. You can't ask me about the dollhouse or anything like that. I could get in serious trouble. Go. Please, just go. I need this info. Name your price. She's not here, and I barely even knew her. That's all I can say. It'll be worth your while. Try to remember. We're not supposed to accept anything from clients. Everything goes through the shift bosses. I, I can't just... Nobody came looking for her. Nothing out of the ordinary happened? There was an incident with a client. I don't know the specifics. One doesn't ask about these things around here. Tom might know. He and Evelyn were close. Go ask him. And please leave me alone. This incident with the client, what happened? Nobody saw, nobody knew who attacked first it was all a mystery. Then they just buried it. No more questions, not another peep about it anywhere from anyone. Where did it happen? In her booth. Number... 11. Booth 11 occupied now? No, it's been out of order since... You're gonna help me. Need to get into that booth. Why? What for? Not your biz. Can you open it or not? I can, but that's it. Won't answer any more questions. Tom knows something. Go bother him. Tom, who's he? Friend of Evelyn's. Wasn't a free moment they weren't together. Where'll I find him? He's a doll here. Works the VIP area, booth two. Thanks. Shh. <laughs> Don't ask for me again, ever. Ungrateful shit. Let's take a look, shall we? See that? See what? Nothing there. Exactly. Should be a port right there for the doll to jack into. They rip it out? Wonder why. What's this? The client wasn't the one who flew off the handle. Something bitter in the ass.
What do you think? Cyberpsychosis? Sounds crazy, but she could have been remotely hacked. And that runner? Weird. Cyberpsychosis doesn't just make you flop around on the fucking bed for nothing. Blood. Fresh, not too much. Put it to a wound rather than a kill. Put this to its body in here. Nighty night. Tech ability for that. Ability for the hat. <laughs> Ah, oh, fucking hate things like this. You better keep this short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day is too much, even for me. Might have gone wrong here. Not really sure. Uh, I don't have your details. 
Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. You sure you're relax. You don't need any data, don't need any deeds. I'm not a customer. Here to talk. To you specifically. Not to be with a doll. Tom, is that it? Uh-huh. Need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. Mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Osaka or Oslo? Which was it? Uh, Oslo. Yeah, definitely Oslo. That accident involved a client, did it? Found blood in her booth. Ah. Uh, you know, shit like that happens here sometimes. And everyone's cool with that. We get new implants, recovery leave, and, well, sometimes even a payout. Now that I think about it, it is weird she went away so far. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Where can I find this Woodman? Probably got his feet up in the back office. Except it's off limits to customers. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. <clears throat> Now I gotta wait till that fucker fucking leaves. <sighs> to bother is not a way to just get through here without all right there he goes sake, man. No worries, DF. I'll see you later. Thank you for hanging out. not going to be fun. Who are you? What do you want? Chill. Keep calm. I'm looking for a girl. Thanks God out of hand, I'll admit. 
or cooperate, and no one else will get hurt. All right. You're the queen of fuck-ups. You're not helping. Now what? Too bad you can't talk to dead people. Oh, wait. You're doing it now. Anyway, just scouring. That just might work. That's fucking insane. Oh, God. It's insane. Fucking half eaten cheeseburger. Oh, nice. Cold blood up. Um. So, let's see. Um, don't have enough for the tech ability. What about reflexes? Not quite, I don't think. Slow and steady. Uh... Sold her off to a ripper. Chip was busted. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy Toy's wet dream. <clears throat> Every last security man to the club. Dumb. Right there, see that? 2 a.m. They hauled every last security man to the club. Looks like they called Tiger Claws for backup, too. Tiger Claws moonlight is peeping toms. Always got eyes on their dolls. Know what goes on in these booths. Then, data mine the behavioral chips. Saw that twist coming a mile away. Had a hunch? Still, wonder if it's for their own use or for sale. And who'd be buying? Two ticks. Um...
Well, I can leave now. You may leave the cloud, but will the cloud ever leave you? Shit. Alright. Um. Alright. What the? Great fucking weapon, my god. I'm required to return your weapons. No, I. Hey, I don't know anything. I just work here. Ability. We need a Grace Monkey, True Craftsman, and Field Technician. True Craftsman. Uh, gotta find where Field Technician is. Grace Monkey's here, but we need level 12 for that. <coughs> Field technician it's there. Take the elevator. Nice work back there. Ever thought of applying for the diplomatic corps? Yeah, honestly, no time Let's for winning friends here. here. Don't have time to massage egos. I respect that. Of course you do. You'd have loved to drop an H-bomb on this place. No need to go so OTT. I've got other methods. One thing's for sure, though. Claus won't forget this. That's fine. Think Fingers has got her? Think we'll find her there? V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. <sighs> All right, so give me my fucking weapon back. Oh, well, that's why it's a fucking... <laughs> uh... Well, you know what I'm gonna have to do. I'm just gonna have to fucking equip it as my second weapon. And basically dismantle everything else. Mainly for the parts. Uh, 
That's a nice fucking chess piece. Look wise, I mean. You had a plan, you tried, it fell flat. Now you're flat. Don't look in any condition to find Helmet. Too slow. Gonna decommission before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. Asked you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See, me and Arasaka, we got a half-century-old score neat settling, and I plan to do it. That's what I need you for. Never been recruited into a terrorist cell before. If you've Listen, been honored, actually... I know things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. Okay, so this... Makoshi... What is it, exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Yeah. Seen the memories. Did a real number on you. Okay, seems we've got a few more things to broach than I thought, but that'll come later. Anyway, when Soul Killer fries, roasts, and boils you, you die. But the contents of your mind get copied to an engram first. Sure. <clears throat> That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Still don't see how Makoshi's linked to my chip problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage, are ya? Fifty years back, ops on the human mind. Makoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. And, uh, how you plan to smash Arasaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? This time, bombs named Alt Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is. Not yet, but you will once we find what we need. For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside Makoshi.
do 10%. Yeah, nice. Hi, you there, mysterious stranger. You who? Yeah, you. There any other mysterious stranger around here? You know what? How about I tell you a joke? Sure, be my guest. What must all trauma team medics swear to uphold? The hypocritical oath! <laughs> okay, what's going on? Hey there, stranger! I'm Brendan, your friendly neighborhood SCSM. And the nicest AI in all of Night City. You can select from a wide range of beverages. Or just drop by for a chat, anytime. Now it's your turn. What's your name? Why am I talking to a schism? Uh, my name's V. Pleasure to meet you, V. Do you come here often? Uh, pretty often, as a matter of fact. I'm sorry. Did I correctly hear you ask if I wanted to join you for a cup of coffee? Um, no. Oh, well, that's okay. Because you can have one now. And just to clarify, we don't have to move an inch. How do you take it? Milk? Sugar? Okay, you've got me. I'm sold. Sold? Nothing's gonna be sold here. Because you know what? I'm gonna give you a can of Night Cola for free. <laughs> Thanks. Brendan, right? <laughs> That's right! Gosh, it's so cool you remembered. Even for a simple SCSM. Do you know any jokes? Who's always limbo champion at mercenary cookouts? The Solo! <laughs> You're gonna fuck the robot dispenser? Nah. Cool. So did you want something from me? Oh, yes. Well, I do apologize for taking advantage of you at this early stage in our friendship. But could I ask you for a favor? What happened? See that container in front of me? It's completely blocking my view of the street. Depriving an SCSM of its greatest pastime. Could you move it a bit to the side? I'll reward you with my undying gratitude. Even though... Technically, I don't stock that. I'll see what I can do. Thank you, V. Boy, are you strong. Here, have a refreshing beverage. On me. Catch you later, Brendan. Catch me? Why? Will I be falling? It's just something you say as a way of goodbye. Oh, I get it. I mean... I don't, because catching has nothing to do with goodbyes, but... <laughs> oh well. Don't humans say the darndest things? <clears throat> Catch you later, V. <laughs> what a neat phrase. <laughs> oh, boy. I promised I'd call, didn't I? Promising's one thing, keeping it's a whole other bag. So, managed to learn anything? Evelyn's not at Clouds anymore. Behavioral chip was damaged. Apparently they carted her off to a ripper dock goes by fingers. Oh shit. Know where to find this fingers character? Yeah, runs a dinky chop shop up Jig Jig Street. Fuck V. Guys, all kinds of bad news. Heading there now, to find her. I told her to stay the fuck away from clouds. Uh, all right, later, V. All right, to Jig Jig Street it is.
is a wicked vibe. So it's more up your alley than clouds. Hey, at least here you know what you're getting. Kitty, kitty, what's the rush? He chipped you for free? Fuck off! Yeah, gear looks a little basic, but it works. Ah, this part. Well, well, what do we got here? And you just the cutest thing. If you're looking for a release, I just might be your man. Got an issue needs sorting out. Here to do that. So how about you fuck off, let me through, and no one will be the wiser. So serious from the get-go? I was only joking. Sheesh. Fine. Let her through, Sludge. Thanks. Gross creepos. Oh, gracious creature! And, and benign! Benedict to the element of your... Ah, through the world with, 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 with bloody stain and brood. Brood butter. It, How are they taking it? The king of Ooh. all we own. I pray to him, shook for thy peace. Arise! Cream roll. Sounds like paradise. 24 hours, you feel no pain and barely remember a thing afterwards. Who can blame him then? Hey, you all right? No way I'm gonna swim! I hate water! Can't you see nobody cares? <clears throat> Fingers. Know where I can find them? If I could, I'd swap, you know? Why does everything have to be s so damn convoluted? In the end, only I got left the shredded cables and empty bottles. I'm scared of your skinny ass. You will be when every mox in town descends on this shithole. You got a financial claim? Take it to court, you pussy. Fine, I get it. Everyone's got their breaking point. Just pay me what you owe me, and you can fuck off the greener pastures. V, hey. And that shit has a name. Something around 25. Hello! There's a line! Nuh uh, you ain't cutting. Sit your ass down Fingers and wait down. your turn. You know him? Heard some things, yeah. Like. His hand sometimes slips. Glad to see a familiar face. I'm worried sick about her, V. Had no idea anything had happened. We'll find her. I know we will. 
After the heist, Evelyn holed up with the Mox for a while, right? That's right. So why the hell did she go back to Clouds? <laughs> Thought she'd be safer there. God knows why. Tried to get her to see straight, but she wouldn't listen. You talked to Fingers yet? If only. He's harder to get in to see than the best docs in town. We're gonna be here forever. I just know it. Maybe you could talk to those girls, see if we can cut in front? Why me? I don't think they like me. Just give it a shot. That or come up with something better. <clears throat> You worked at Clouds. Not as a doll. Tuned their virtues. That's where I met Ev, Tom, and the rest of the crew. She means a lot to you, doesn't she? And you've arrived at that conclusion how, exactly? The moment you knew where she was, you sprang into action. Once you get close to Evelyn, you never want to let her go. Think Evelyn's being kept here somewhere? On the one hand, hope she is, because I want her back fast. But on the other, hope to God, no. Because who knows what that sick fuck could have done to her. You seen a woman with blue hair around here? Had a doll chip. Uh, think I know who you're talking about. Uh, fingers worked on her, sure. She's still here? No idea. Gotta ask him. My friend here, she's in really sorry shape. Couldn't let us cut in front just this once. Uh, uh. Of course. Honey, be my guest. Well, now, hold on. Hold on a sec. Didn't seem so bad just a minute ago. <clears throat> she's a toughie. Keeps it inside, mostly. Now try Come on, let's go. Lips of yours. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Wait, something's wrong. Can't see nothing but a blur. Faceplate's previous owner had a longer face than you. Edges are stretching your optic nerves. Don't worry. Your eyes I think he's adjust. done. We going in? Eventually. Yes, hello. What can I do for you? Need a minute of your time. A minute? That's all? Shame. Could watch those juicy lips of yours flap for hours, days. <laughs> but I'm busy right now. You, Tiger Claws! Far as I know, I'm all paid up. We're with the Mox. The Mox? Why didn't you say so? So, what brings you here? These girls know you're chipping faulty implants. You might say so. I'd say they're the very best I can find. See? What's in it for you? Whatever they have to offer. And they always have something to offer. <laughs> you're a sick fuck. Know that? What do you two want? Heard you help the working girls around here. Well, very few children will play with broken toys. So when skin goes flabby, sockets go out of whack, implants malfunction... I I'm sure you get the gist. You pay for goods, you expect top quality. Consumerism 101. Please, scrapyards offer better quality than this. Evelyn Parker. Need to know where she is. Step into my office, please. Many girls come through here. So many. But let me put it to you this way. I believe in giving each of them the personal touch. Ask anyone. I'm more than a chop doc. See, I know what people truly want. To be flattered. Praised, padded, to feel like, like they deserve it. Of course. Can't speak or what? 
Went jittery soon as I mentioned her name. Don't try getting out of this. I know you remember her. I, I have a neurological condition. It's not easy living with ticks. Really, I'd love to help, but if only I knew who you were talking about. Suggest you start remembering all you can. Either that or I'll make sure you never forget my face. Two beefers from a BD studio took her. Didn't even know their names. Want details, damn it. Name the studio. They mentioned a moth of all things. Virtues with the death's head. Said she'd be good for the moth. Need air. I'll be outside. I'll be more than glad to show you around, but um, uh, later, perhaps. Wow. That's a lot of sex toys. Wow. Okay. Ooh. Don't mind if I do. You are one freaky motherfucker. I let her go back to clouds. Could have stopped her, but I didn't. Don't worry. We'll find her. I know it. We'll fucking find what's left of her butchered corpse. Hey! Keep it together! Wanna give up now? No. Only lead we got's an XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the Death's Head. Better than nothing. I don't get your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. Death's Head symbol bring anything to mind. Anything. Doesn't matter how small. This industry, I mean, market's looking for every kind of fetish out there. It's cavernous, but an XBD outfit would be on the move almost always. Makes them harder to nab, harder to sting. Need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Gotta be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. Yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. Could be we'll see something to point us in their direction in one of their virtues. Ugh, have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Everyone, everything, leaves something behind. Just need to know where to look. Lucky for me, I'm running around with the best BD specialist in town. That's an extra pair of expert eyes. Well, your BD expert has a better idea. Pleasures of Night City. A domain with its twin on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. Might stumble on something useful. Let me think for a sec. No fixer in Westbrook. I'll drop her a line. V. Fixers don't hand out information right and left. Done a couple of things for her. Not that she owes me. But let's see what she has to say. Meantime, see if I can't find something on the NCP domain. I'll wait in the van.
V, nice surprise. What is it you need? How's things, Waco? This is a prelude to whatever illegal favor you're about to ask me. <laughs> what? Never. In that case, they couldn't be better. Kind of you to ask. And you? Looking for a brain dance. Oh, any particular one? Logo on the casing? A death's head moth. Whoa, now. That's quicksand. So I would advise caution. Know who makes them? Where they scroll them? And do you know what a fixer does? Allow me to explain. Not only do I finalize transactions, I can accomplish the goddamn impossible. <clears throat> Which would be... Making sure the buyer, supplier, and ever-neglected intermediary not only keep their heads in the games, but keep their heads, period. So don't you ever ask me who, with whom, where, when, why, or how. <laughs> Can you get me one of those recordings? No, but I have a pretty good idea who can. Who'd that be? There's a store on Jig Jig Street. It has a Pandora's box worth of crap in sight. Try asking the owner. Thanks, Waco. Where's your cute little ass rushing off to? Slow down. What this one Treat did. yourself to a little R E L A X X. Yeah, I can see that. <clears throat> you chosen something? Looking for a uh, something special. A uh, brain dance to really. You mean smut? No. More hardcore. Won't find it here. But there's a guy on Jig Jig Street has a whole lot of peculiar flicks. And I mean peculiar. Got something that'll keep you wet for hours. Oh, boy. Just a bit more careful. But I was. Looking for and something I gotta raw. Work out, you know? Untouched. Raw's all you get with me. What's your edge? Want something that'll Anyone pour to me. See a jelly really roll, scramble the neurons. You got it all, man. Bare knuckle sure. boxing, shootout, black ops interrogations, amputations. For a week. No, 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 no. I mean, something and if like, I don't work, we're well, both going you know, fetishes. No, come on. You know what I mean? No, I don't. Think I'd be doing this job if I could read minds? I want to know what it's like to, to kill somebody. See? Wasn't so hard. So, got some classics from the last Corp War, or armed robbery if you're looking for something fresher. What are you looking for? Back to you again. Looking for BDs. A particular kind. Particular? You a badge? If I was a badge, you'd already be in cuffs for what you sold the customer before me. All right, all right. Can't be too careful. What do you want? Give me the best of the best. Ones with the death's head. <sighs> Didn't know I was dealing with a connoisseur. Death's head will cost you, though. How about a discount for your newest customer? Only give regulars discounts. If you're short, then fuck off. <clears throat> Got anything that might interest me? Acid bath, deleted scenes, hard disk deleted, hardest disk deleted scenes, 
No arms, no problems behind the scenes. No limb hardcore, the making of. Torture Mix Volume 15, the making of. Jesus. Pleasure doing biz with you. Right. Before. Well, not before, but. Hop in. Um, I'm gonna actually leave this bid here, and I'm gonna do that uh, tomorrow. I need to get some sleep. So thank you guys for hanging out. I appreciate you. I love you. Hope you guys have a wonderful week. If I don't see you tomorrow, and I will see you later.